about four different types of slope today. You are going to mirror me, which means that you will look just like me. Okay, so the first thing that we're going to do is we're going to put your hand like this. So your hand is going this way. Okay? This hand over here, this hand right here, this is our friend Joe. Okay, so here's Joe. And Joe, unfortunately, he can only walk to the right. If the line is like this, okay, and Joe walks to the right, the slope is positive. Okay, so say that with me. Joe walks to the right, the slope is positive. Again, Joe walks to the right, the slope is positive. Okay, so this would be a positive. You switch it around. You've got Joe. Joe only walks to the right. If he's walking downhill, Joe walks to the right and it is negative. Okay? So if Joe walks downhill, the slope is negative. Okay, say it with me. Joe walks down the hill, the slope is negative. Okay, you have 30 seconds. Turn to the person next to you and tell them about a positive and a negative slope. Good job. I'd like to see how everybody was using the gestures. Okay? The next type of slope goes like this. Okay? It's a horizontal line. Joe can only walk to the right. So if Joe walks straight to the right, your slope is zero. Okay? So do it with me. Joe walks to the right. It's a straight line, so the slope is zero. Okay? You can also call it a horizontal line. So Joe walks to the right. On a straight line, the slope is zero. Okay? So we call this a zero slope. Okay? The last type of slope is a vertical line. Here's Joe. Well, unfortunately, Joe can only walk to the right. So he walks to the right and he falls over and he crashes <laughs> all over the ground into multiple pieces that he is undefined. <laughs> so, Joe, okay, it goes that Joe walks over the line, he falls down and he crashes, so he is undefined. Say it with me. Joe walks to the right, he falls over the line, he crashes, so he is undefined. Turn and tell your neighbor.